Hello YouTube. Uh, I haven't made one of these videos yet. I'm just. Uh, uh, I just think I'm gonna make a video because uh, thanking my family, specifically my mother and my grandfather, for um, giving me the opportunity to uh, become a PC gamer. And, uh, I'm not a good representative of the PC gaming master race or whatever they call it. But, uh, uh I'll try to make this video kind of short, short as possible. I don't know if I can. Um, well, uh, I'd say about 2012 or so. My mother helped me get a together a PC, uh, very basic build. At the time, it was pretty good. Um, let's see what it did have: uh, AMD FX 4100 processor, um, eight gigabytes of eight data RAM, 133, 1,333 megahertz. Um, at the time, Corsair, um, power supply, um, um, an Asus motherboard. Let me get the exact model. I think I have a book in here. With the exact model. That it currently has in it right now. I can just find it. Crack my gun. It is a. Oh my god. It's going to be destroyed. It is a M5A97 motherboard from Asus. Asus, whatever. Uh, <coughs> Since then. Wait, is that everything? Um, I got, I ordered a drive that didn't work, but soon after that I bought myself a, uh, a USB DVD R CDR drive. I think from LG. Yeah, it was LG. Um, See what else? Uh, it's got liquid cooling from Corsair. Um, let's see. Uh, and as you see, I need to shave. Yeah, I really do. I look too dirty to be a member of the Master Race right now. This, this is early morning right now. Uh, Everything I've done in this computer, I did it myself. Uh, just nothing major. Definitely not motherboard, but I use this a little, an old flash drive. Very old. I need to get a new one of those. But uh, I guess I'll do a little review too uh, with the PC gaming thing. Since 2011 or so. The past four years has been, um, I mean, I'm not a very wealthy individual. My family's not, so, and, uh, but even so, it's been pretty easy to upgrade little by little over the past four years. But it has been kind of, uh, well, it's, it's 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 been fairly easy, but you have to actually have a passion for it. You have, it, it, it has to be a hobby, and uh, if it's not a hobby, then you would spend that money otherwise for other things, you know. And uh, um, oh, but I'll touch more on that later. I'm going to get to the actual PC itself. Um, and I don't know if the 
words and the video sync up properly. <laughs> but as you can see, I'm using some crappy recorder there. But uh, this is my monitor. It's not a monitor actually. It's an HD TV um, insignia. And I bought this maybe uh, a few months ago. It was my last upgrade. And I don't have a 1080p monitor or I'm a TV or a, uh, I don't have a 4K monitor or a 3K monitor or a 2K monitor. Um, I do have a monitor, but I replaced it with this TV. And I, some people say it's not as good. But I actually like it better, a lot better. So, and I intend to keep this for a while. I mean, I don't stay on the front line of top of the line hardware. You don't have to do that to be a PC gamer. You you really don't. Um. So you got a few things here. That's my USB hard drive which I bought. And all these are just my own upgrades I made, but without my mother's help, I would never have gotten this started, this project. It's lasted about five years now. And uh, there's my wireless in receiver, I bought that. There's my, um, what's it called, uh, amplifier of some kind, I bought that, very cheap. I got, a, I got an Asus um, USB, it's a Blu-ray drive. And, uh, not pretty, but there it is, my computer. Um, I call her Simple Sally, so far. And, uh, yeah, I mean, I bought this keyboard. I think I bought it at Walmart, and actually it's a Razer Deathstalker. Yeah, I bought it at Walmart. And I'm going to be getting a new mouse. This mouse is old. My brother gave it to me. It's, uh, the clicker is going out on it. I bought a mouse just in time. And my desk is old and crappy. Uh, well, I mean, I got my case off, as always. I always do that. I just prefer it that way. It runs cooler. It may not be the best, the, the most effective at moving air, but it keeps it cool for me. Let's see, uh, I've got a fan and a hard drive. For my hard drive, I should say. I've got an old, um, an old SSD for games. And a uh, just a normal old 7200 RPM 80 gig hard drive for my C drive. And uh, as you can see, wire wire management is not important to me. <laughs> uh, and uh, yeah, that's her. That's my computer. It's not that flashy, but it's functional, and it actually runs games that pretty good pretty good performance yeah, so uh, that's not right <laughs> that's not right at all see what it looks like well, as you can see I need to clean up in here I keep cleaning up and and waves. Too much to do. Not computer related, of course. Uh, I feel dirty. I just look dirty for some reason. I don't know. I just woke up. But, uh, that's my computer. And I lost my original screwdriver, so I'm gonna have to use this when I, or I, I order some new parts in the mail. Um, what I get? Uh, that rare AMD FX processor called a uh, 6120. It's a sixth core. Uh, 
also got a, uh, a Asus GTX 760 which is about two, one or two cards up from the one I got now so it's not a major upgrade but it's all I could afford at the time so. uh, that's all to say really all my games are on Steam now Minus the ones that aren't, because I got disc games too. Uh, let's see, uh, let me change it to picture view, and I'll show them to you. Okay, get the camera again. Um, these are my games. Let's see, you got Divinity, Oblivion, Skyrim, Fable. Fallout 3, Gothic, which I, I don't really particularly like that, but I got it for real cheap, like $7, well actually like $4, I got Gothic, Gothic 2, and Gothic 3 all for $4 or $5, so that was all bundled together. I've got my Guild Wars 2, which isn't a Steam game, it's an MMO, but it actually works with a Steam Relay, unlike World of Warcraft. And uh, that's just one of those uh, trials games that pop up on my screen every once in a while. I never, I never download them because they only last a, like a day or two. <laughs> and it, by the time I download it, 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 it would be gone. So, and I've got Kingdoms of Amalur Reckoning, which I, I, I actually enjoy that game a lot. People don't like it very much, but I do. Metro 2033. I won't last light, but I'm... I'll settle for that one. I got Overlord, Overlord, Raising Hell, and Overlord 2. I only played this one so far. That one. Uh, a friend gave me this game. I, it's kind of some, <laughs> some kind of speed puzzle game. I just downloaded this yet um, past two, uh, two and a half days, which was insane for me. We don't have the best internet, but damn, I mean. <laughs> It must be a really big game. I haven't played it yet, but and I only got it for like uh, eight dollars and eighty cents, thanks to my granddad. And that's another point I'll bring up in a minute. Um, the Witcher, which is a great series. I've got one and two. That's just my Steam games. I've got other games. Let's see. Uh, got them on disc over here. I got Never One of Nights 2, I got Doom 3, I got uh got Doom 3. I got um Hellbeat London, uh, Dragon Age Origins and Awakening. Dragon Age 2, which I haven't played yet. Um So I mean mainly I buy my own games. Uh but I've got a lot of help from my grandfather. I mean, really good help over you know a few games here and there. So I just want to thank my mother and my grandfather for allowing me, you know, giving me giving me help to with this project of mine. It's become a hobby, and I know we don't always agree on things, but. They have given me a a great gift that I've um, more or less just upgraded on my own. And uh, but if it wasn't for them, I wouldn't have been able to do it at all. So I thank them for that. Uh, well, so uh, well, I guess. Uh, Which, I don't know what else to do with this video. I've never made one like this before. I'm very, uh, eh, you know. <laughs> but, let's see. What could I do? It's kind of lame I gotta sit here and think about what to do in a video. Uh, by the way, that's my dog. I can't see her. She sleeps in her at night and then early in the morning he goes out at six. 
that clockwork. Yeah. It was daytime. So, I'll, uh, I'm a night owl myself. It's the only time we get to play games. Life has gotten very hectic. It's just turning it into a video blog. Uh, well, I'm a PC master race, but uh, I'm kind of a peasant too. Not the fact that I have a console. Or play console. I have a console and I'll play it. I don't have any games for it. But, uh, we're well, not mini games. Uh, the original point of this video was to thank my mother and my grandfather for lending me aid and, and building this PC. And I couldn't have done it without them. I wouldn't be Master Race if it wasn't for them. But I don't even remember why I switched to console, uh, not console, but PC. I, at some point, I, I just, it was more ex like an experiment. I, I, I never th even dreamed of it, and then I did it, and then I just stuck with it, you know. It's not that I hate console, I don't hate console. I mean, I don't like the shitty graphics or the commercialism real bad, but uh, I like my good monitor, but I can use that on Xbox 360. I can also use a sound system that doesn't work on PC, and I have to use my headphones on the PC so far, but if I wanted to, I could buy yeah, sound system. I just haven't got around to it. Uh -huh. But I can make a video why I switched. Uh, I just, I didn't want to feel, I don't feel, I didn't do it that, uh, over some superiority complex or, I just heard that, you know, better graphics. Uh, few things interest me that are on PC like Steam and World of Warcraft especially I mean I think that was one of the major reasons I switched to PC was so I could play that for a while and that was interesting that was really interesting World of Warcraft was and now I got Guild Wars 2 which is almost as good in my opinion some people may say it's better but I think it's good really good it is but um, I don't have a top whatever reason. I just, it's just personal preference for me. I'm about the, I think I'm the only person here that has a PC like this. And that's got to you know, makes me feel odd sometimes. If you feel like a fucking uh, lurch. <laughs> but. Oh well, you know. can play any game I got max settings my, my Skyrim looks amazing I've got mods for the, and the texture package and plus I broke my own car settings because I use uh, extra cooling so yeah I mean <clears throat> I probably <laughs> I probably made no good points really I mean that wasn't the point of the video. The point of the video was to thank my grandfather and my mother. Well, my mother and my grandfather, both, for uh, giving me the help the help I needed to build my PC. I just thank them so much for that. And if I do go back to console, I wouldn't need their help. Which, I mean, that is a money thing, really. I mean. It is, it's true, PC does cost it. It does cost you. I mean, and uh, 
someone with not a lot of money like me, you know, it's, it's kind of costly. I mean, it can be. But, uh, technology in general is getting costly. I mean, it's, the front line of it is the, the top of the line, you know. My computer is not top of the line. Yeah. It doesn't have to be. There's a huge, there's a huge gap between performance and price that people just don't take into consideration. Like my my PC is not spec wise like anywhere near top of the line when you think about it. I mean, in a way it is, but. <clears throat> I can play Skyrim and it looks fucking crazy. But that's just one example. And what other games do? Uh, Never Winter Nice 2. Old game. It sings on my computer. And, uh. I don't know. We're not all graphics wars. I mean. Like, I play RPGs that are old. Some are newer and don't look that great. I mean, the RPG genre isn't focused on graphics like FPSs. And, other games like that, you know. <clears throat> but I'll go ahead and end this video. The whole point of this video was to thank my family for helping me build my computer. I just threw some extra points in there. So, uh, stay right there. Have a nice day.